Welcome to Thriftmas Day 11, everyone. My name is Julie, and today we are going to finish thrifting in this Goodwill. It is the same Goodwill that I was in in yesterday's video. We're just going to finish looking through the rest of these shelves and see what we can find, and then I will share with you what I picked up here at the very end of the video. So let's go thrifting. As you can see, this is the same picture that I showed in yesterday's video and talked about. So if you would like kind of an explanation on what's going on with that picture, be sure and watch yesterday's video. And even though we are right in the middle of the Christmas season and the Christmas decor and the Christmas gifts and all the things, as an avid thrifter, my mind is always looking for items and home decor that I can use all throughout the year. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that I thrift for all seasons all year long. So I am definitely looking for those pieces that will work in winter decor, spring and summer decor, and just everyday home decor. So I am not here just looking for Christmas. I am looking pretty much every time I go thrift for all seasons. This little box here is just another prime example of why I always say and give you the little tip of always check the boxes because when you look in this box, you can clearly see that this is not any type of silverware. It is a little glass dish. So always check your boxes at the thrift store. So I'm going to give you a little tip on a couple of places to check in the thrift store that a lot of people forget about. Check your end caps because a lot of Goodwills are putting little things in bags like this and placing them at the end of aisles. So I have found some really cute things in these areas and sometimes they get overlooked by people. So be sure and check there. This little three-piece set here looks a lot like the black shelves, shoe shelves that I got at Ikea recently when I cleaned out my closet. And so that's not a bad price for $4.49, I believe it was, for all three of those. Thank you. 
The other area I wanted to remind you to be sure and look at is up. Always look up. I have not said this in a very long time in any of my videos, but I do want to remind you to look up in the thrift store. That is the number one area that people forget to look for things is up high. Y'all, there is some cute, cute things up high. You'll be surprised what you find. You might have to ask for some help to get it down, but definitely check up high. Okay, so now we are going to move into the thrift haul. And the first thing that I picked up on this second half of this Goodwill thrifting trip was these little furniture glides. I just recently showed in my very first Thriftmas video for this year, my brand new farmhouse table. And I'm thinking that I'm gonna put these in the very bottom of that table just because the legs are so old and like they're wood and I don't want it to really scratch up my floors or anything. So I might try and add these to that. If I get these in place, I'll definitely show that to y'all in an upcoming video but that is the reason that I bought these they were pretty inexpensive I don't know how much they cost retail but I didn't think that $1.49 was a bad deal so I picked those up Okay, and moving along to the next item that I purchased was this glass container with this wood looking lid. I don't think this is, I don't know, this could be real wood. I'm not really sure. This looks like something you would get at Target, but I got this because I am needing something to put my OxyClean in that I use in our laundry. Sometimes we have laundry towels and different things like that that just need a little extra boost and boost, excuse me. So I like to use OxyClean powder in some of those loads of laundry. It's easier for me to keep things in a closed container like this because my laundry is literally on my porch. I have an enclosed porch, but that's where my washer and dryer is. So having the laundry in the box and not sealed up, it gets moisture in it and gets kind of clumpy. So for me, having things for my laundry in something sealed up, like I said, is best. Okay, that is going to wrap up today's thrifting trip to Goodwill. Thank y'all so much for coming thrift shopping with me today. We hope y'all have a wonderful evening. We love y'all, and I'll see you back here tomorrow with a brand new video.